to find inverse laplace transform of this equation first we will apply partial fraction to factorize this equation here for this term s square there will come two factors a upon s and b upon s square this is for this s square s whole square then for s plus 1 whole cube there will come three terms c s plus 1 plus d s plus 1 whole square plus e s plus 1 whole cube three terms for this s plus 1 whole cube s plus 1 s plus 1 whole square and s plus 1 whole cube for the whole cube whole square the terms come that much number of times on the left hand side there is 2s minus 1 divided by s square s plus 1 whole cube on right hand side take the lcm of the of this and this is this much divide by s there will come a s s plus 1 whole cube and in this term divide by s square there will come b s plus 1 whole cube i can write this s plus 1 whole cube common and a s plus b will be in the bracket so this is the simplified form a s plus b in one bracket and s plus 1 whole cube as a common okay for next three terms while dividing by this s plus 1 here will come c s square s plus 1 whole square while dividing by this s plus 1 whole square there will come d s square s plus 1 and when i will divide by this s plus 1 whole cube then there will come e s square okay. so this is our numerator denominator is common in both sides so we can cancel it out okay so i can remove this denominator now first we will simplify by expanding these two terms and then we will compare the coefficient of s okay. 2s minus 1 on the left hand side yes a s minus b a s plus b expansion of this is x cube plus 3s square plus 3s plus 1 this is expansion of this term plus c s square expansion of this is s square plus 2s plus 1 this is expansion of s plus 1 and d s square when multiplied by s will become d s cube and then d s square plus e s square these are the terms now i will multiply this bracket with a s then this bracket with b to get to simplify this this is a s to the power 4 plus i multiply by this a s to each and every term in this bracket plus 3 a 3 a s q plus 3 a s square plus a s okay. then i am multiplying by this b that is b s q plus 3 b s square plus 3 b s plus b these are the terms after multiplying by these two brackets then plus c s square multiplied by s square c s 4 plus 2 c s q plus c s square plus d s q plus d s square plus e s square these three terms i have written as it is okay now i can remove these upper two lines now 2s minus 1 on the left hand side 
and on right hand side i will take s4 as common and coefficient will be a plus c s cube common and the coefficient will be 3a plus b 3a plus b plus 2c plus d okay. 2c plus d these are the coefficient of s cube coefficient of s square coefficient of s square 3a 3a plus 3b plus c plus d plus e and coefficient of s are 3b and a coefficient of s is a plus 3b and the constant term is the single b okay now i'm going to compare the coefficients of s on both sides to get the value of these to get first equation so compare this s4 the coefficient there is no s4 term so its coefficient will be zero this is first equation coefficient of s cube there is no term of s cube so coefficient of this will again be zero is equals to zero this is second equation now s square there is no term of s square so 3a plus 3b plus c plus d plus e is equals to zero this is again our third equation coefficient of this is equals to 2 a plus 3b is equals to 2 and the constant is this is fourth equation and the constant is minus 1. Constant term here is minus 1 and here is b. So, this is b is equals to minus 1. So, we got b directly from here. b is equals to minus 1. Substitute the value of b here so that I can get the value of a. So, here a plus a is equals to 2 minus 3b and b here is minus 1. So, this value is 2 plus 3 that is 5. So, our second factor, second constant b uh, a comes equal to 5. Now, write down the value of 5 here. So, c will come equal to minus a and that is minus 5 from the first equation. Now substitute the value of a, b, c here in this equation 2. So we can get the third coefficient 3 multiplied by a that is 5. I am substituting values here plus b and b is minus 1. Okay, minus 1 plus 2 into c. c is again minus 5 and plus d is equals to 0. So solving it for d, we will get d is equals to minus 15 minus 15 and plus minus 15 and plus 11 so our d is minus 4 okay i got c as minus 5 d as minus 4 to get the value of e substitute all the values here a is equals to 5 b is equals to minus 1 minus 1 c is minus 5 d is minus 4 plus e is equals to 0 substitute all values here in third equation we can get the value of e and the value of e is equals to minus 15 plus 3 plus 5 plus 4 and that is 5, 4, 9, 3, 12. That is minus 3. Our E is minus 3. Now I will substitute these values here in the first equation. A is 
nothing but 5 and substituting the values back into the equation. B is equals to minus 1. So, B is minus 1. C is minus 5. C is minus 5. D is minus 4. D is minus 4. Minus 4. And E is minus 3. These are the factors we got. Now, taking the inverse Laplace transform, taking inverse Laplace transform, transform of this equation. it this equation will become it and this 5 by s is I, inverse is 5 multiplied by ut okay minus 1 by s square is t minus t multiplied by ut that is unit step function because each function is uh, usual it is uh, hidden but uh, it is multiplied by with this ut minus 5 s plus 1 is e to the power minus t you can write this ut here also ut and you can leave it because it is optional and it is hidden function minus this 1 upon s plus 1 whole square is t my this 4 will come here 4 t e to the power minus t e to the power minus t because of this s plus 1 and this whole square will be the t minus this s plus 1 whole square the laplace of this s plus 1 inverse laplace of this s plus 1 whole cube will be this will be t square and uh, this uh, 1 upon s plus 1 is will be t square and divided by 2. Okay. This because uh, it is Laplace of this t square term is equals to n 2 factorial and this is n. So 2 factorial divided by s to the power n plus 1 that is q. So here will come t square divided by this 2 factorial that is 2. So Laplace of this s plus 1 whole inverse Laplace of s plus 1 whole cube is t square minus 3 already written constant divided by 2 and t square e to the power minus t that is 1.5. So this is our, you can write ut, depends upon the way, because every function is multiplied by this unit step function. This is the inverse Laplace transform of the given equation. Thank you.